Hi guys. Hi. Greetings from Germany. Yep. <laughs> Today is a great day. Uh, we decided to hike and uh, this video we give you a little update about our new toilet. Arrived, and now let's unbox the beauty of our toilet that arrived for our new truck. So you're gonna see that. We're gonna do a little unpacking. Um, also, thank you caravan shippers, uh, the guys that uh, ship us around the world and can also ship you. They have a special bottle, a special gin bottle uh, with their logo on. So we decided to have a little game a giveaway. Uh, a giveaway. <laughs> uh, it's kind of a lottery because we don't have so many bottles. <laughs> <laughs> the only thing you have to do is you have to uh, follow Caravan Shippers on Instagram. And of course, if you didn't do so, live and give 4x4. Mm -hmm. And tag two people. Yes, tag two of your friends, at friend, whatever. And in one of our next videos, we're going to announce the winner. Yes. And Caravan yeah. Shippers said, I can keep this one bottle, but mm -hmm. they have another one and that's going to be shipped out to you. Exactly. <laughs> so yeah, enjoy this video. Mm -hmm. Have a great day. And we have news. Soon we're going to pick up our chassis, our new, we can say so much, new Mercedes chassis. Mm -hmm. So, and you're going to be with us. Exactly. So stay tuned. <laughs> I am Isabella and I am from Brazil. This is Fabian, and he is German. We've been overlanding the world with our home sweet home, Frank the Tank, for the past almost four years. And together with our son, Matteo, and our two lovely dogs, Uni from Spain, and Basco from Germany, we are living even for before. Subscribe and welcome to the family. And now let's unbox the beauty of our toilet. Now we're gonna open the nice box. This one, I assume it was pretty heavy, is the toilet itself. So when we open it, nice. We have a lid style toilet seat, which is with soft close. Oh wow, we gotta see this. Come here. Check it out. This is going to be our toilet. So before I take it out, I already, I know what I ordered. So it's a compost toilet. And we show you more when we unpack it. And like when you want to ship this around the world, I think it will manage. Look, nothing can damage your toilet, I hope. It's not heavy. <laughs> it's totally not heavy. Can you see the beauty? Can you see? I didn't see it like it, but you are seeing it. In Ta-da! This moment. There's our toilet. Check it out. Woohoo! We are super excited. And that's the lid on top. This is a compost toilet. It's also a compost toilet. So you separate the pee pee and the poo poo and then it doesn't smell and you don't need any liquids, no chemicals. And the good part is no tank, nothing. Everything is in this baby right here. So here we have a lid that opens and closes even the back. So you, when you open your toilet, you don't have to look at your poo poo. And it's separated, front is pee, back is poo. So when you open this baby and you close the lid, you have a five liter uh, bucket for your pee-pee, which is full. This toilet even has a sensor. It shows you when it's full. It's like a light here, a blue light that comes up. Then, understood, trying first time here. This is the pee-pee. And this is for your poo-poo. So if you want to use coconut flour or whatever flour, we have to figure that out. You can use that bucket and it even has a stirrer. This is the unique part about this toilet. And this stirrer is not manually like in some other toilets you know out there. No, this stirrer reacts on a push on a button on this side and then it stirs for I think 20 seconds. So that's pretty cool. 
you can put it back in. Really easy. Like I said, this was my first time doing that. You take the bucket, empty, put it back in and you close your lid and this lid if you want to and you're done. Mm -hmm. So I just opened the toilet and took out a lid uh, just in case something spills over which we don't hope so you can take out all those things and clean but here you see the electrics in our case we have 24 volt in our truck so this is a 24 volt to 12 volt converter this thing here is the stirrer it's a machine that will rotate we can only show you once plugged in here are the cables there's an outlet for cables but this is how our toilet looks like cool The reason why we decided for this brand and this company is because a part of the good quality no, that they have and the design is we don't want anything like manual to steer everything. This has like a nice button, looks like a house, toilet, it's pretty cool, it's amazing. When we have on the truck we can talk a little more about it, how is to really the day by day, how easy it is to empty. Supposedly it's pretty easy in this model and the pee bottle is also pretty easy to empty and this was the big factor for us something that we don't need to take apart everything and make a big mess and we got another package also from compost toilets and ta -ta. comes with a little baggie that's really nice. I talked to Nigel and he said if you want to you can carry your bottle around but I don't think we need that for that case. We're gonna use it because it's really nice. It also comes because we ordered, I just told you over there, you can use the stirrer but sometimes maybe you just want to use like a, a normal plastic bag and no stirrer. It comes with an extra bucket and you can close this bucket. So here can be a plastic bag inside and you don't need to use the stirrer. Then Oh yeah, that's nice. When you pee, like I said, we will show you that later. When we pee, there's uh, this, I think there should be minty smelly, that when you can, even as a guy, you can stand up peeing, and then this distributes the pee pee, and it doesn't smash all over your bathroom. So that's pretty nice that we have that. You need to dry out whatever is in there. So this toilet has a fan that blows 24 seven, and in order to blow it out, it's nothing smelly, it's just that the moist goes out of your bathroom. Um, this pipe is gonna be connected right next to the toilet and you're gonna blow out. So there's also an electric fan in there that uh, does that automatically. And here, ta-da, we have an extra pee, pee bucket just in case we don't manage to empty our toilet, but I doubt that we have a problem with that. Yes, uh, now here you saw the toilet. Isn't it a great thing? Yeah, thanks again, Compost Toilets, for shipping it out to us. And yeah, it's gonna be great. It's gonna be now in integrated in our new truck. And yeah, here you see a little how it looks like. But uh, of course, we're gonna show how this is gonna look in the truck when we build it in. So again, thank you, Caravan Shippers, for this gin. Here's the bottle you can win. Um, it's a lovely bottle. It's from uh, Northern Germany. So Caravan Shippers wrote how it tastes here. You can see that. So yeah, it's a lovely present. Thank you. And it will be a lovely giveaway for you guys. And you know the rules, here they are again. So first of all, follow Caravan Shippers on Instagram. Then please go to, if you didn't so, go to Live and Give 4x4 on Instagram, follow us and uh, tag three of your best friends in the picture you're gonna see with a gin bottle or us with a gin bottle and you're gonna be participating in this lovely free giveaway in the next video we're gonna announce the winner of this nice gin bottle cool. <laughs> talked about it while walking uh, our toilet before was a cassette toilet Nothing wrong with that. It's just uh, throughout the years, you know, we had two cassettes uh, to exchange and it started smelling and it broke sometimes off-road, some plastic parts. And anyways, when you mix pee and poo, um, it can be smelly. And if you believe it or not, we, we saw it with other travelers. 
or smelt it or not smelt it <laughs> when you make when you separate pee and poo it's totally fine then nothing smells so this is why we decided for a composting toilet instead and this version you can have either with a stirrer you can really do compost we will try that obviously but also we have another bucket without a stirrer where you can just have a bag in it and you just uh, the poo goes in a normal bag and you throw it away with your normal waste so basically that should summarize why we decided for a composting toilet thanks for being with us thanks for tuning in here and yeah we're gonna have lots of news about the new truck and soon we're gonna be back on the road so there's excitement coming along and in this weather it's not so easy to sit and not move except <laughs> a little walking but uh, it's gonna be great <laughs> so see you when we see you bye bye